Today we want to show you our factory and we need to go to our production area. That's why we need to wear this and I would love to show you around. that we use in our photo production lights. Uh, hence my co-worker to show you. You can see we currently have two cupolas in production. On the right, this is the setting where we produce the curing ovens. Uh, actually, right now we have about I think about eight orders. We have another uh, production zone where you can see a couple of more curing ovens being ready and about to be shipped. Some, uh, uh, we have the pleating machine there, uh, we have some pressing machine over there, all packed and uh, ready to be shipped. Oh, this is very interesting. We have developed a small uh, line for experiments for one university in China. So you can see this, this is a small curing oven for rock wool. On the left there you can see right now we're producing a few heat exchangers. They are used in the uh, CO recuperation system after the uh, cupolas. The big monitor right there. Yeah, so we have everything there. <coughs> Take a year. Uh, 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 right here we have the metal working station. We have our uh, CNC machinery. You can see. percentage of the components that are used in the stone wool production lines that we sell by ourselves. Uh, all these small components, maybe on the left, we can show you. So, all these parts that you see. We try not to rely on outer suppliers for a lot of the components. There we have another metalworking uh, plant, but the uh, equipment there is not as sophisticated as in this one. Ok, 
Okay, here is more quiet so I can talk more normally. We have our painting section right there. It's a closed section. Here we have some uh, drums that you can see that are packed and ready to be shipped. Actually, you can see a couple more there. So this is the central part of the drum collecting chamber. Uh, you can also see this is a heat exchanger, for instance, on the left. This is another heat exchanger. Here we have a burning chamber. There on the left, the long black device. This, the yellow parts here. These are from the drum. So this is all for large drums. We, we produce drums to about 5.5 meters of diameter. So maybe we can go to the electronics section so we can show you how we do our electric cabinet. So this is the electronic section. This is where we assemble our electronic cabinets for controlling the whole systems for solar production. As you can see, we have many of them that are already completed. Uh, we're testing, getting ready to be shipped. Here we have a system for binder preparations. The two cabinets that you see here, they're ready to be shipped. Let me see if I can open one of them. I don't know if I have the ability. So, as you can see, we use, as you, as you can show here, you can see that this is Siemens. We work a lot with Siemens, Schneider, ABB. Uh, for this equipment, because it's for the local market, we use lower series, S7200 Smart. But abroad, we use 1500 series. Uh, we tend to... We don't want to make compromises with the quality as it comes to projects, especially when it comes to projects that are uh, located outside of uh, China, because we are developing our brand and we want to put something that will last for many years for the customer. So we are in front of another production warehouse that we have in our uh, factory and we want to show you inside. There we, we produce the cross-cutting machines. We actually have a couple of them uh, in the end. In this section we have the longitudinal uh, cutting machinery ready to be shipped. We have a couple of curing ovens that are uh, also in a finished stage. You can see our brand also. We uh, are very proud of our machinery, so we show our brand to our customers. And, uh, the other zone. This is the frame of a 2.4 meter curing on. This 
now work inspection of ours. We have uh, plasma cutting machinery on the leg. There is our laser. There we have another plasma. You can actually go to see which elements we're cutting right now. So as you can see, we're doing the metal plates for the curing oven. This is all done uh, with laser. Uh, and I can tell you from experience, not every company in our field is willing to invest in such equipment and to do it with laser. You can see the cuts, how professional, professionally done and how smooth they are.